or by floor, helped by some six horsepower of mechanical aid per worker. At any height, the old shout, tee up, is always welcome. It's just the job too after a spell of this kind of work. The city, which since Roman times has consisted of this one fabulous square mile, where the value of the ground is about five pounds for an area which a five pound note would cover. The new city and skyline will harmonize with and incorporate the best of the old, especially the Wren churches, some of the finest of which are being restored. These stones belong to St Mary Le Beau, London's oldest church building and probably its most famous. Some of these stones are millions of years old and bear the fossils and marks of the seabed. The stonemason, George Hannigan, follows the tradition of Wren's craftsmen who restored this church once before. Scaffolder Henry Perkis, though, will have another 80 feet to climb to the top of the new steeple before bow bells ring out again, and they will. You need the steel nerves of a mountaineer for this job. There won't be any traffic jams in tomorrow's city. <laughs> 